Okay, today we're going to take a look at a little issue I have been having with my VMware workstation running a VM and taking snapshots. So the issue is typically the snapshot should be fairly quick, uh, less than 10 seconds or so, depending on how much memory and disk space your VM is taking up. So we can see here we have our Windows 11 VM. It's running pretty normally. It's got 16 gigs of RAM. It's got six CPUs. You can see there if we put our logical processors in the view, we have a six CPU, 16 gigs of memory. It's an SSD. This is an NVMe drive that this VM is on. So it should be fairly fast. The issue comes when we try and take a snapshot of this VM. And we can see here that our performance on our system, we have our recording for OBS Studio, which is what we're using to create this video. So here's our F drive. So let's filter this out. Okay, so we'll be watching the F drive, this virtual machine and its disks and its VMEM, basically just the F drive here. So what we'll do is we'll take a snapshot of this virtual machine. And then we can see down here in the corner of the save state, this should go fairly quick. This should not be counting up this slowly. It should, it should be done by now. And we'll see over here. That if we take a look at our we look at our virtual machine we can see how slowly this is going 12 megabytes a second so it will get to a point where it's fairly slow and only doing 10 or 12 megabytes a second okay so we're up to 70 percent now And you can see that the speed of this has slowed to slowed down to about 55 megabytes a second. And then the last few percentage of this snapshot is going to run pretty slowly. Okay, so the snapshot's complete. That took, I'm gonna say it took three or four minutes at least. Um, I'll put a timer in the video to see how long exactly it took. So we're going to try and fix this issue. So let's take a look at how we can do that. But we're gonna shut down this VM. Actually, before we do that, let's delete this snapshot. Okay, this process is pretty quick. We can see in the disk activity that deleting the snapshot is fairly fast. So we can see here that this is reading multiple disks and that are going four or 500 megabytes per second. And if we add all this up. And the snapshots deleted. And it took about 30 seconds or so. Okay, so let's shut down this VM. And we're going to go ahead and we are going to edit the VMX file. And we're going to add some entries to it. So to do that, we can find our VM. We can select it. And that should bring us. We should be able to navigate to the location here of that. We can right click and select open VM directory. And here it is. Here's our VMX file. We'll open up our file with Notepad++. We'll head down to the bottom and we'll add the two options. The first one is going to be main mem dot io block pages equals four zero nine six. So we're setting this to basically four K blocks. 
The second one is main mem dot io wait. And we're going to set that to zero. Save the file. And we'll just double check, make sure it's saved. It should be there at the bottom. Okay. So there it is. So let's go ahead and restart our virtual machine. So the issue is when the virtual machine's powered off, the snapshots are instant. We'll go ahead and we'll power it on and compare how quickly these snapshots take place. Because since there isn't an issue with taking the snapshot while it's powered off, I actually find it faster to power off the VM, take the snapshot, and then power it back on. Sometimes you can't or don't want to power off the VM and you want to get a snapshot. So this is something that we want to do without having to power it off. And we will go ahead and we'll take another snapshot. Let's see how it performs. Here we can see in the performance, we are going at almost a gigabit a second on this snapshot and it's complete. So that should resolve your issue with the time it takes to take a snapshot. I believe these options were set inside the v inside the default settings for the VM for spinning hard disks so that your VMs taking a snapshot wouldn't take all of the resources of your disk. So they put in some checks and sums and IO weights so that it would do the snapshot a little bit slower and wouldn't use up your disk resources. Uh, but in the modern age with NVMe drives that can go multiple gigabytes per second, that's not an issue anymore. So I hope that helps you with your issue with taking snapshots in VMware Workstation. This should resolve that issue. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.